Hello my friends, welcome to the channel and in this video I'm going to show you how you can improve your computer performance quickly without having to upgrade your hardware or even having to clean up your computer. Many of you might know this trick already, but if you don't know this trick, then I'll share it with you today. So yeah, stay tuned, let's go. Okay, so what you gotta do, you just gotta go to the Windows desktop, then click on this search icon here. And right in the search bar there, you can search power. And it's gonna be giving you a few options. It's gonna show you power and sleep settings. And this is your basic settings for Windows. And here you can choose what to do when your computer is plugged to the electrical outlet. So let's say you want to shut off your monitor after a certain time. It's not being used. I usually put it on 30 minutes. This way it's not going to shut off when you use it. Also, you can choose when to put your computer to sleep. I usually put around three hours in case I'm uploading any videos online or if I'm downloading anything. I want to make sure my computer is not going to fall asleep and then it's not going to download anything. So I just put three hours, but you can choose whatever you like. You can you can choose five hours or even put never if you don't want to save any energy. But these are just basic settings. We just got to go a little bit further and go to additional power settings. And here with this trick is if you have bought a computer and it just came up preset pre-installed Windows or if you have just installed Windows yourself, it usually has a preferred plan set to balanced. This way it's balancing your performance and your power consumption. So it's kind of nice to have when you're using it on the laptop. This way you're going to save some battery life. But if you're using it on a desktop and you want to get the maximum performance, make sure you choose either high performance or you choose the ultimate performance. It's going to consume more power, but it's going to give you the maximum out of your hardware without overclocking it. So if you're not thinking about overclocking your system, you can still use this setting. It's going to make sure that all the components get the maximum power from your power supply. It's not going to save you any energy, but it's going to make sure that you get the maximum performance. So if you're doing gaming or if you're creating content or any other work on your computer, this is really cool because you can just choose ultimate performance. Your computer start, is going to start working much faster. And I'm just going to show you here what it actually changes here. You can go to change this setting. So here it shows you all the options that this power plan is controlling. And as you can see, it controls your hard drive. So you can choose when to put it asleep. So you can actually scroll down through all these settings. There's a whole bunch of settings, but the main setting that's gonna give us more power and more performance from our hardware is this one. It's gonna be the processor power management. It, it shows you the minimum processor state and the maximum processor state. And we want to make sure it's set at 100%. This way, your processor is going to be working 100% and it's not going to be cut down on any other performance. Because I feel like you, if you don't set it at 100%, you're basically living performance on the table. You're just giving it away, you know, because you have the hardware that's capable of doing a better job and you want to be using it at its max performance, especially if you're doing gaming or any content creating like video editing you can go back and make sure it's set at ultimate performance so yeah this is it this is that simple well i hope you find this video helpful and it's going to be improving your computer performance so if you like this video please click that like button also subscribe to the channel so you don't miss new videos and i'll see you guys soon bye bye